Golf is an ancient game and two of the city's golf courses are about to be things of the past as well. Little Rock Mayor Frank Scott Jr. wants to close a budget hole and THV 11's Willie Hoy tells us they've made the decision on which courses are getting cut. Dawn and Marlisa, the announcement came last night. The reality set in today at War Memorial and Heinemann Golf Parks. Mayor Scott has big plans to quote repurpose them. For golfers though, today felt like a funeral. So we're talking about the future of Little Rock. In a country club setting, Mayor Frank Scott is out to explain why he needs to end golf at Hindman and War Memorial Munis. We can't sustain four golf courses in the city of Little Rock. We can't sustain two. And so after a tournament through July 4th weekend, Venerable War Memorial will shut down. Heinemann in the southern part of town also will close up. It's part of the budget deal passed by the city board to save $2 million. Golf will go on at Rebsman and the first tee. The mayor says there's no possible way the city could afford four golf courses. All the golfers here, though, they look at the crowds and say that can't possibly be right. It's got both sides saying the price is wrong, Bob. I think the city is making a big mistake. Terry Green is a regular at War Memorial. He went to the board meeting to complain, but thinks city leaders had already decided. They're going to have to spend money, a large amount of money, to save money on these golf courses. But the mayor says all that land will be put to good use. He sketched out some ideas and a task force will be formed to make suggestions. Interim programs will be in place with facilities for other sports on the horizon. Mountain biking, you can see uh, more parks and trail systems to have a true connection between Hyman Park as well as War Memorial Park from a running perspective. The mayor is a proud millennial. Those ideas fit with his vision of the city. For Green, his Greens fees are likely going away. I'm, I may not play anywhere else. I might quit. Take fishing up again. Now, Mayor Scott spent some time on social media to answer people's questions and complaints. One big one, parking and tailgating for Razorbacks games. He said the agreement with the University of Arkansas does remain in place and it will be a part of future plans.